Yo, what's poppin' boys and girls, ladies and gents? Welcome back to another episode of Kicking the Bass TV. Let me tell you guys, we have some really cool swim bait action for you today on some big swim baits, big glide baits, catching some really good fish. But we also have a giveaway for you guys, so I'm gonna run that real quick. You guys know a few months ago we gave away a Lose Mach 1. In today's video, we're gonna be doing it again, right here, brand new, spanking new. Lose Mach 1. If you guys want to enter to win this reel, all you have to do is be subscribed to your boy's channel. Hit the notification bell. Hit the like button on today's video. And if you could, drop some comments down below on videos that you want to see here in the near future on your boy's channel. Once you do all those steps, you'll be entered to the giveaway. But to give you guys a little background on today's video. So we ended up linking up with my boy Mike, my boy A-Dub, my boys over at Slab Dynasty, and my man Fletcher the Fisherman. And we actually ended up going fishing. We we're filming a video later in the day and I ended up just not catching enough fish for it. We ended up catching a few really good ones on a glide bait. I was with my man First State, but we just couldn't finish the video. So we ended up going back out about a week later and I went out with my man Cody and we just caught some really big fish. So I have some awesome footage for you guys. You better stay tuned. It gets crazy in this video. But let's go ahead and hop into it. Mike. Mike! He's gonna break my little rod. Ah. <laughs> it's working. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah. You ready? I'm Let's ready. Let's get it, dude. Come on, bro. How bad are the nets? Oh my god, bro. I literally just ate one. This is like one of the worst little net days I have had. Oh my gosh. It's not, it's not a good time right this second. It's not a good time this second, but it's gonna be a good time when we hook a big fish, right? Oh, and this is the glide bait that we're gonna be throwing. This is actually an S waiver. I don't usually throw glide baits. We're gonna try it today. I'm, I'm still new to swim bait fishing. Like if there's anything in bass fishing that I just don't know too much about, it has to be fishing glide baits. Um, I'm not too advanced on it. I don't do it all the time. So today's gonna be a learning experience and I'm hoping that we can get some really big ones to eat it. So let's go ahead and tie this thing on our rod and get to casting. Hopefully we're gonna hook one that's like five or six pounds. I don't even, I don't know if I had a spring on it. Oh my god, dude. Look at the boil. Look at the boil. Oh, dude, hit me again. Hit me. Oh, dude. Oh, it's a big one. Oh, it's a big one. Dude, right away. Sorry, bro. The boat. The boat's going crazy. Look at that fish. Dude, it's a big one. <laughs> yeah. Dude, on the glide bait. Are you serious? We just got out here. I cannot believe I got one that quick on it, dude. Oh, dude, that's a good three pounder, man. That's a solid three. That's a good fish. Look at that sucker right there on the glide bait. You gotta love it. You gotta love it, man. There we go, boys. First fish is a dang good one. Just think about that one, Mike. That's, that's a good, a beauty right there, it's a beauty. Bro. Almost had a double up, but hey, it happens. I, I told Mike, I was like, hey, bro, could you grab my camera? And the next thing you know, there's one <laughs> eating his. Dude, look at that slab, bro. This is slab. Thank you, buddy. You made my day. We made my day. All right, boys and girls, we're going to get it started with old Mr. Glide. Let's see how she looks next to the boat. This thing is, this S waiver looks so good. Look at that. I think we can have a really big one munch that thing up right here All let's right. go ahead and get started throwing this thing around and see if we can get us an old big old bass to eat this glide bait today i have a feeling that we're gonna have to make a lot of casts but it can be worth it so let's get it started big bass oh my god i got one already dude there's no way there's no way i just got one i don't think he's big at all yeah he's tiny dude what that's insane though <laughs> what look how small that bass is he bought the size of the dang swim bait that's crazy though to catch one right off the rip Look at that. Literally not too much bigger than that swim bait. And we got our first fish already. I cannot believe that. I was not expecting that. I was expecting at least an hour before we get a bite, to be honest with you. 
and we sit here and we catch one right away. It's a good little sign. Thank you, baby. What a crazy thing, man. Fish that small to eat a glide bait? <laughs> you never know. Well, that is exactly how you want to start off the day is to catch one right away. That's the best feeling ever. Especially on this bait. Dude, I was not expecting that. Like, the last time I fished with this, we had a ton following it, but really didn't have many commit. And that fish just ate it right away. Like, I had big ones kind of not committing to it. And then you just have one that's a little bigger than the actual bait. Just eat it just like that. Very interesting. It's crazy what goes through bass's minds. I mean, that's a pretty big bait for that little bass to eat. You guys are wondering what we're fishing here. You got like this little tiny pocket. You have this little corner right here on the corner. I just saw something busting. You got all these lay downs. So I'm throwing it right off the end of these lay downs in hopes that there's a big one sent off on the end. It is a little windy today. If it wasn't windy, I'd be able to, it's super clear water. I'd be able to like watch my bait and kind of pay attention to what the fish are doing behind it. If I needed to work it different, but with it being a little windy, it's hard to see. But let's just keep throwing this bait and see what we can do. Oh, dude, I got a freaking good one behind me. I saw him just tailing it. Oh no, he's still behind it. He just came right out of the shallows right there. Yeah. Dude, that was crazy. It was like a big just blob coming towards it. Oh my god, dude. He followed you all the way. Yeah, I didn't see him until last minute. Yeah, that was like a solid three pounder. He was like right at the boat, dude. I never saw him follow it in, but I saw him dart off. Yeah. That's the thing with these big swim baits, guys. You know, you have so many followers. I just don't want to commit to it. That's why I was surprised that that small one just literally didn't even hesitate. These bigger fish are a little smarter though. Oh my gosh, he ate it right there, dude. That was crazy, he's fighting so hard. Oh my gosh, he ate it at the boat. It's a good fish too. Oh man, guys, that's unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. Oh my God. Guys, that was insane, insane. He's blind, that's why he ate it. I caught the stupid one. There we go, guys. That's a good fish right there. And let me tell you why he ate it. Look at his eye. He's blind in one eye. Mr. One Eye Willie. To watch him come right up to the boat and eat that thing, that was just amazing. All right, we're gonna get a weight on this guy. It's a solid two pounder, maybe two and a half with how dense he is. Let's get an official weight. An official weight ski. See that? 258, a little over two and a half. Well guys, there we go, solid two and a half, 258 on scale. That's a beautiful fish. I cannot believe the way he ate that. Like that was just so fun. I can't believe it. I was not expecting him to commit. There he goes. Oh my gosh, Cody give me some on that one. That nice That's fish. exactly why you fish that glide bait. That's a lot of fun right there. I just literally saw him at the boat i don't know if my gopro could see it but he literally stopped at the front of the boat i twitched it one more time and he ate it C cannot get better than that well guys it feels good to catch that fish right there the fact that he ate it at the boat just makes it so much better we're gonna go down this bank there should be some fish I'm trying to kind of 
hide out of this wind. The wind is so brutal today. It's aggravating as can be being in a little boat like this and trying to film a video. It's just be a little aggravating, but we're gonna make a bunch of casts around some of these laydowns and in some of the shade and see if we can call out a really big one. I know we could catch like a five, six, seven pounder on this thing today, so we're just gonna have to focus up and see if we can get big girl to bite. Oh, I had it on, dude. I had her on. Oh, man. The hook, like, stuck to her when I hook set, yeah. and I had her for two seconds, and she darted off to the left. But uh, I threw under right next to that tree, and I saw the branch move, and then I watched her eat it. Dang. <laughs> Guys, that sucks, like throwing this thing and you see like all the fish that follow it back and just miss it. I'm just glad that one ate it at the boat, but it can get aggravating because it's like, man, you see so many big ones and everything. And then all of a sudden you just can't, you, know, you can't get them to commit to it. But I think we're going to have one opportunity back here. We just got to capitalize like one good opportunity. I'm surprised we haven't had a ton of followers come back. Yeah, one follow you to the boat. That was crazy. I can't believe he ate it. <gasps> oh, dude, it's a freaking monster. And he dove over the top of it. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, do not spit it. Oh did you see that dude? Unfortunately. I mean just like it wasn't even a bite, bro. Like he didn't demolish it. That was aggravating. That fish was over four. That was a good one. Got to keep on casting though. Can't let that get us down. I think there's some more over here. That just sucks because that was such a good bite, guys. And and he just, I mean, just waylaid on it. You don't get many fish that like actually commit to it like that. So when it happens, you know, it's it's a little upsetting. But we just got to keep on casting. Man, that that stinks. Me and Cody were just talking about. It. I was like, I. I think we're gonna get a big one right back here and we had our opportunity and that that was it couldn't have been a better bite he came out of the water to eat that thing he just opened his mouth shook his head and it was off i saw him trying to come up dude and i was like please don't do what i think you're about to do they spit these things easy too it has so much leverage Dude, that bite was so cool. I don't know if you saw him eat it, no, but he, he dove over it like a topwater, dude. He wasn't a five pounder, but he's every bit of four. Yeah. It's just unfortunate, but what can you do? Gotta keep casting and hope that we can get another one to do that. Dude, he just, oh man, I've never had a glide bait bite to where he just came out of the water like that to eat it. That was just cool. He was going to eat that thing, bro. He didn't hesitate. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. You're not a giant, but I freaking slammed it. Look at that. Please don't come off, baby. You're not a monster, but you're not a bad fish. <laughs> yes. Please make it in the boat. Yes, sir. That is a freaking fat guy. That's over two and a half. That's two and three quarters. Looks like it. <laughs> Eat that glide bait. See, we lost that fish, guys. It can be depressing sometimes, but 
you throw back in there and get one that's almost three pounds that's that's rewarding i still think we have a chance to catch a big one back here though these fish seem positioned on the back bank over here so that's a beautiful one though wow and since everybody asked for the weights you know i'm just gonna weigh them because i don't even want to hear it <laughs> zeroed out he's a little over two and a half I can already tell i mean i can just tell you that he's probably like two six or two seven he was two seven two five seven about two six is it locked in there yeah two five seven yep. little over two and a half pounds pretty fish i just wish we would have landed that big in a second ago but i think we're gonna have another opportunity that's just a pancake right there thank you bubba thank you bubba you got him? Big him? No. You fighting good? Yeah. <laughs> God, look at your rod. <laughs> oh. That was awesome. High one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a nice one. Say impossible. He just literally nosed up to it as I pulled it out of the water. Cody's got him a good fish, dude. A dang good one. He can jump right up in here. He's a little skinny though. Yeah. A little skinny. Yeah, they're definitely on a diet. They're definitely here. on a diet. I told Cody we need to go get some celery, maybe some carrots, and maybe broccoli, you know? I think that I think we'd be better off than throwing this big old beef steak. Look at that, dude. That's a dang hamburger if I know of one. They want cauliflower. They want cauliflower. Yeah, that's what I thought. They want the veggie burger. Oh my God! He's going in. Oh my God. I was sleeping. I was sleeping, dude. I, I was actually asleep and I felt him just tug on it a little bit, you know? Unless you think I should try these trees right here one more time. Oh my God, I got him. That's a big one, dude. It's a big one. Yeah, it's a big one. It's a freaking giant. I haven't, I haven't got to see him, but oh my God, dude. He's huge. Please stay on, baby. Please stay on. He's running at me. Dude, he's big, Cody. I don't know how big he is, but he's big. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Dude, he's big. It's a four and a half pounder, at least. That's a four pounder, ain't he? Looks like it. It's hard to tell with his mouth shut. <laughs> Got mm. Gosh, that's what I've been waiting on. Mm-hmm. To shake him off too. That's a good one. Hey, that's a good bass right there, ain't it, brother? That's a fish that you want. She a high three, man. What you think? Yeah. If dude, it's just so skinny, man. It's so skinny. But if it, if that were a bigger fish, that'd be like four and a half. Like it's got the body for it. It's just zeroed out. Yeah. Three seven eight. High three. Yeah. I'll take it, bro. Almost four pounder on a swim bait. You gotta love it. That fish was fighting so good, dude. That's a dang good one. Almost a four pounder. Yeah. That's what we want on a big swim bait today is a big bass like that. Yeah, that's a big one. Thank you, baby, for biting that thing. 
go back to your home. <laughs> yes, that that makes it all worth it, guys. Like me and Cody, we've been talking. How many times have I brought it up, Cody, about that fish <laughs> I lost? Oh, I've been bringing dude, it up the whole like, time. Yeah. The whole the whole rest of the day, I've been thinking about it. like, man, I miss that fish. And I know that one's a lot smaller than the one that I had back there, but that's a dang big one. So to catch it on this and to actually shake it out of his mouth when he was on the boat is interesting. But let's see if we can catch another one, man. I think we can catch another big one. Oh, Cody, I got another one, another big one. Yeah, dude, another big one. Oh, he freaking came off. No way, dude. No freaking way. No, dude, dude, he's back on. He's back on. There's no way that just happened. There's no way that's the same fish, is it? Oh, it's big and too. It's not big. He's not as big as that last, but it's dang big. Oh my gosh. Dude, how much better could this get, Cody? If I get him in the boat, it'd get even better. Mm-hmm. <laughs> how much better could that get? I mean, not much. Dude, how much better could that get? I mean, guys, come on now. That's a high two. Let me weigh him. Listen, man. I'm just gonna keep weighing him. You guys want me to weigh him, you asked for it. Zero that. What you think, Cody? I'm thinking two eight something or two nine something. Two seven six. Two nine one. Oh, there you go. Almost three pounder. That's a good one though, ain't it, brother? Yeah. Dude. He tackled it, dude. I cannot believe he came back and ate it. That was it could. A cool, that was a cool clip. It was. It was. It could have been a different fish, but um, man, three pounder like that. <laughs> Let's go. Let's freaking go, dude. I cannot believe he came back for that. I, I stuck him the first time too. That's the crazy thing. But then again, you know, when you think about it, you have all these fish and they travel in schools. That could have been a different fish than the first one. But at the same time, something tells me that, you know, it could be the same one.